Hello, Speed Gaming, and welcome to the first of 10 qualifiers for the Any Percent Tournament. I am Memes Are Healthy, and my co-commentator is... Tablespoon? Oh, Tablespoon, are you excited? Aren't you excited? This is the first qualifier for the Any Percent Tournament. I am. I think that we're going to see some sick Super Metroid. Yeah, so we got two very talented runners on screen. Professor School and Nevdi both are going to be running PRKD. And all that means is the boss order. They're going to be going to Fantoon first, uh, then Ridley, then Kraid, then Dragon. Also referred to as the new route. And here we go, we're kicking it off. So, Tablespoon, you got any thoughts about this? Oh, no. Um, I'm, I'm just excited, man. We're straight off to Sirius Ridley. Uh, there's a slight desync in the start, but that's okay. We should be all synced up now. Okay. Nice, while jumping up the side, as, as you should. That is right. These are not the only two racers I should add. There are 25 entrants for this, which is crazy turnout. And there are nine more after this. Who do you think is going to get a better series escape time? Well, I mean, Presser School is getting the better door times already. I'm locking it in. All right. I'll take Nevity. I believe. Oh, no. He got steamed. It's over. So, yeah, pretty pr pretty basic standard speedrun stuff. We just want to get through these rooms as fast as possible. This is pretty much just an auto scroller. You know, we, we do it every time. All right. Still solid times from both runners. Very solid times. 45 something. <laughs> 44 something. I don't, but we take those. I will not Still complain very about close any of for sure. Yeah. Hopefully we don't see any uh, dips into moat today. Um, past yeah, that, so that, that should be should be pretty good. Yeah, so that's the really scary part about uh, doing new router PRKD, whichever uh, one you want to call it. But moat, uh, which we will get to when we get there, is a very heavy reset point, and hopefully neither of our runners will take a little dip, take a swim. Oh, and Professor School is apparently coming off a fresh PB, so he's feeling hot already. We got both Moonfalls. We'd love to see it. Saving those free seconds. Mm-hmm. Very nice pit rooms from both players as well. Yeah, no detours in the pit room. So we're just going to be making our way through the the real early game, the real slog. We got to get all our standard uh, items that just kind of let us maneuver around the map and um, open doors and stuff. Not too, too much to note here. Uh, you'll notice uh, the runners are going to be moving their arm cannon up and down. All that does is just uh, move Samus forward by one pixel and over the course of the run, it's going to save some time. So might as well just do something. A relatively clean early game so far. Not, not too many mistakes. Uh, yeah, no, no, no glaring lead. issues. Yeah. yeah. Professor School does have a very slight lead so far. Things can change drastically in these next few rooms, however. So hopefully they go well for both players. 
Uh, for those popping in, yes, this is the any percent tournament, not the ran, not the map rando or other rando. Ooh, Arthur School having a little bit of a hiccup, doing wall jumps, and Nevdi wrecking the ledge grabs. I'm a ledge grab enjoyer myself, so we love to see that. Me too. Grab climbs OP. But overall, very nice climb room from both our runners. Professor Scribble up to low. Wow. Yeah. Oh, we got a clash of the Titans here, showing off different strats for each room. We got to, they got to show us uh, which ones are better. I think that's what we'll decide. This race will decide. Solid bombs times from both runners for a no reset. Hopefully, bomb Tirizo doesn't scam and gives missile drops. That's the other. That's the. That's one of the rough things about these races is yeah, you just got to roll with the punches. There are no resets here. Yeah. Oh, Professor School having a little bit of a little bit of a hiccup there. So Nevi is going to pull ahead just by a little bit. Oh, oh, they both neither. Wow. Oh, man. It's very unfortunate. That can happen, but they both should be OK. There is a nice, easy farm in one of the upcoming rooms. That should guarantee them both a missile drop. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah, so Nevdi is going to bonk the okay. door. So is Professor nice. School. Nice. That sets them up for this perfect little old angle and shoot. You saw that that got them each uh, missile drop. This room is more important than it may seem in this route with how resources can be impacted. So it's very good that they both got through with full health and full missiles. And we are going to be missling through those pirates there because we want to conserve as much HP as possible because we are going to a area of the game much earlier than intended by the developers and the enemies there hit really, really hard. So they could, if they take a few extra hits, that could mean that it's over. So we want to try and conserve as much HP as possible. You're now heading into early supers. One of the staples of a Super Metroid speedrunning, we get to access super missiles uh, much earlier than intended by using a tech called the mock ball. Why don't you explain that, Spoony? Well, with a certain set of inputs, you can preserve your run speed while in the morph, and that allows you to slip under the gates and access the super missiles early. Uh, both of these players are just constantly going back and forth off of small mistakes it's actually really interesting to see how yeah, much it's the lead neck has and just neck barely right changed now, going frame for frame right now yeah this is so close always love to see a close race Yes, also, and both of these... Sorry. Oh, sorry, you go. I was just going to say that it's also interesting that their resources are ever so slightly different and how they <laughs> yeah. can change different things. Oh, no bug boost from either player as well. That's so close. This is sick. Oh, oh Mr. Mr. School is going to have to go back for that super. Supers are very important throughout the run. We really want to be grabbing all of them. So it makes total sense why he would go back for that. Hopefully, clean red tower from both players. Oh no! Oh no! Nevdi unfortunately taking a hit from the Ripper and having to climb back up. That's okay though. That's why we call Recovered it the Tower very quickly. of Pain. Still not very far behind. Yeah, I, I expect to, there to be many more lead changes uh, because. You never know when something's going to happen. And plus, we're coming up on one of the big ones. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
Very nice resources for Professor School as well. Yeah, both of the runners are very healthy at the moment. Nevdi's going to conserve a little bit of HP by um, placing that power bomb and not getting choosing not to get hit by the CAC. Professor School has two more missiles, but that shouldn't matter too, too much. He has a little more health, so he, he uh, is probably feeling a lot more safe for Fantoon. Alright, we're coming up on Moat. This can really make or break Ooh. a run in the early game. Oh! Okay, so Nevdi is going to have to press jump frame perfectly to get the CWJ while Professor School does the HBJ. Oh, oh and he no. gets it! <gasps> no! And Professor, Professor School, School falls in the moat. And so just like that, you'll see that this is very, very heavy reset point. Oh, oh no. Unfortunate second HBJ miss, but that's okay. He can bring it back, I believe. Nevdi's making his way down to Fantoon. Nice. Let's go, okay. okay that's we're awesome. In. We're, now we're locked in. It may seem that Nevdi is relatively far ahead at this point, but the way Fantoon works, it can go either way. Fantoon can give very slow patterns to Nevdi and very fast patterns to Professor School, for example. So who knows what may happen. Yeah, that time that Nevdi just gained, he could lose it right now if Fantoon decides to do Fantoon things. We got three patterns we can get. Obviously, we want the fastest one, but unfortunately, that is the rarest one. And the most common is the slowest. So let's see what Nefty gets here. Oh, an unfortunate slow for the first pattern, which, like I said, is a I believe it's a 50% chance. Oh, and he missed a missile. Oh, Nefty's kind of in a tough situation now. He this is seemed to have uh, he's going to need to have a really good Doppler here, which is uh, just getting in as many missiles and another slow. So just like that, slow, slow, average pattern. Oh, oh and the disappear. Oh no. Okay, Sorry. but fast, hooked up. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Wow, great air Doppler from Professor School. Oh, and Nobody's the scam the slow. Oh, and Professor School also gets the scam slow. Okay, Nevdi still has a decent lead. Oh, oh no. Fortunate padding by Phantom. Okay, fire. nice. So just like that, I believe Professor School made up a ton of time right there because of Phantom oh, yeah. doing whatever he wants. But yeah, very heavy RNG point in the run. He can do all sorts of crazy things that we don't like. At this point, Professor School's resources are pretty good, except for his health. Yeah, I was going to say, his... Nefty is health looking is not very great. peachy. Oh, yeah. His health, he has perfect health, perfect missiles, supers. Nefty is feeling good. Yeah. Professor School's feeling pretty good as well, but looking at that health, it is... Not not looking good. We need at least 121 HP if he doesn't take a hit so we can get through bowling. He's definitely going to want to be careful in Attic and the uh, Pancakes and Waivers room. Things can get scary in bowling for sure. Very nice Attic from Nebdi. Professor School's going into Attic himself. Oh, that's uh -oh. very unfortunate. Those do a lot of damage. We're... Okay. Oh, okay, he got Good hooked up. Drops, at least. Yeah, so now, now we're looking. Now, we're, now, now it's not looking so bad. <laughs> Nebdy making his way into bowling. So you're going to see that we have to intentionally take two hits here. So that is why we need at least. 121 HP because the spikes there do 60 damage each. Oh, and he gets another health drop there as well. Right. Professor School is looking awesome. 
Yeah, these resources are much better. I can look at the resources for both runners. Uh, pretty good, I'd say. Yeah. Uh, eight supers on Professor School, nine on Nevdi. They want... I, I'd say the sweet spot for uh, this route is having at least two power bombs, because um, it just it, it guarantees that you're going to have one uh, for two rooms coming up that make them faster. Well, you need one uh, to break the tube, which is actually required. And doing it earlier uh, is faster than later. All right. It seems that at gravity pickup, Nevdi has not quite a twenty-second lead. But the runners are about to be entering a very difficult section in the run where time can easily be lost. So the lead will likely change. Who knows? Yeah, Nevdi is looking very, very comfy in the in the missile department and power bombs as well. He doesn't have to take any farm there. He chooses not to. We'll have to see what Professor nice School Evers. does. I suspect he may skip the farm here. But we'll just have to wait and see. Okay, looks like he's yeah, opting, to farm. opting to farm. I like that. I'm always a huge uh, farm enjoyer. Just takes yeah. takes a lot of RNG out of the run to get those guaranteed super drops. Right, playing safe with your resources in a race is always a valid choice. Yeah, especially in a race setting, we we want to try and be as safe as possible while also going as fast as possible. So Nevdi just picked up Spazer, which is going to be a nice increase to our damage. Uh, which is going to speed up the boss fights uh, more like... Yeah, yeah, Mother Brain and Ridley tremendously. Oh, oh that is no. not good. So Nevdi unfortunately hit the door transition too early to break the tube. So when he comes back, he's going to have to relay that power bomb, which is going to cost him a little chunk of change in time there. And the reason the runners... Uh, oh, no. The oh, that's not good Kojark either. super as well. Yeah, wasting supers is not something that we, wanted, we want to happen. Yeah, that's true. As Glove mentions in chat, at least Nevdi didn't soft lock, as that is I, I, possible. Okay. That was what I thought happened, and I had a mini heart attack. Oh, oh and Professor nice School super and business center. And we just we don't want supers, I guess. <laughs> and maybe Professor School is just you know even even in the player field, he saw Nevdi might have dropped a super. He said, you know what, I'm gonna be a nice guy. I'm gonna I'll drop one too. Yeah, going out, going moving through Upper Norfair. We're gonna be farming a lot. We're picking up some key items: high jump boots, ice beam, speed booster, wave beam. You know, we're getting the works, and we're gonna be trying to farm as much as we can along the way so that we don't lose time having to go out of our way uh, to farm. Hopefully we get some good drops here. I'm curious to see if we'll see a shark farm after this ice beam room. Probably not. Yeah, their resources um, seven are pretty su good. Supers and missiles are looking good for both runners. Yeah, he's going to opt to just go quickly through the room. Oh, this is... Oh, oh, okay. Nice little okay. backup from Nebdi. Yeah, that can be a very tricky room, and if you do not get that mothball out of the room, you will have to go the long way and go over the gates, as intended. So, very happy that that did not happen. Yeah, Nebdi's just going to choose to run through those... Uh... Oh, that's unfortunate for Professor School. That should be fine. Yeah, he gets under. Ice escape can certainly be 
a nerve dragging trick. Old Mountain, a very scary looking room, but Nevdi making it look easy. Certainly not hard to lose a lot of time in bowling. Yeah, that is, it is very easy to just fall down and keep falling, and it's very glad that Nevdi got through that. Hopefully, unscathed. This Bowl Mountain will be clean from Professor School as well. Oh, and he's opting, he actually opted to farm that there. I like that. Yeah, farming everything in the room, that's nice. So as Nevdi grabs, doing a little bit of a high five here in the speed hallway, I like that. I'm interested to see how much Nevdi will farm. Yeah, he only has five supers, which is not good. Okay, all right. Those are those are good drops, I'd say. Eight leaving. Could have certainly That's... been worse for a three yeah, farm. That... Yeah, farming three, getting three. We like that. Yeah, and having these extra supers here allows him to super missile these uh, missile doors, which uh, is obviously much faster than using five missiles. Let's see what Professor School gets. Okay, three for three. We like that as well. And Nevdi opting to pick up wave missiles, uh, which I like to see because yeah. we do not want to see any uh, <clears throat> ammo mishaps in Torian later. So picking up that five extra missiles could come in clutch. And Professor nice. School grabbing them as well. Awesome. All right. Oh, and then you take in a little gander at the room there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, oh, what's way there? down to Lower Norfair. Yeah, so Can now we're getting to one of the... Another really important trick in the run and a very scary part in the run. Nevdi coming up on Lava Dive, uh, or Lava Spark, excuse me. Which, if he gets, will save him a lot of time. Oh, he's going back. Didn't like that first charge. Looks good to me. Okay. Oh, oh no. that's unfortunate. Yeah. And he took a hit from the uh, Namahe there as well. So he's going to have to do a backup here called a Gravity Jump. He's going to jump, turn off gravity. And he's gonna have to turn it back on here. Oh, oh no! no! I don't this is... think Nevdi can survive this. Uh, what what is he gonna do? I'm yeah, not sure. I... Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna go back and farm. So he can go back and farm HP and Professor School having to do the gravity jump as well. Yeah, so he's gonna choose to go back and farm just to be safe here, making sure that he finishes. I like that. Yep, so he can farm HP right here. Yeah, at least he might he might be, he might get to get a second attempt at uh all the spark. That's all he wanted. So yeah, yeah, just like that, Professor School is going to pull ahead going into lower Norfair. Yeah, this round is very hard. Um Lower Norfair is a very difficult section in the game it's it can be very easy to die on oh, uh, professor school getting a very nice pillar spark there this is a very scary room it's called the worst room in the game for a reason oh not quite this is why this is why <laughs> oh no so he is going to be down a power bomb now but it should not matter i don't think as long as he doesn't miss any more as long as he gets to this. Oh, taking that hit there is unfor- Oh, this is why it's the worst room. It's terrible. I hate it. Actually, sorry, no. He's still okay. As long as he no, gets he... it here and does a bomb spread and keeps yeah, the so stairs room. Unfortunately, now he's going to have to be very safe with his HP not taking a hit nice. anywhere else. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, this room is terrible. Why'd they put it in the game? Oof. I don't know. All right, but we got there. Oh, oh and Nevdi missing no the pillar spark, so he's spark. gonna have to. Sorry. Yeah, so he's gonna have to power bomb his way through. So both runners are gonna have to do what is called a bomb spread 
uh, in the upcoming room uh, because they're going to need uh, two power bombs to open two power bomb doors. I'm Professor School getting the spark farm. I don't know. Reduction. If... Yeah. Yeah. So killing those it's two pirates. The game, Nevdy. <gasps> What? No, he has to uh -oh. get power bombs I... of shame. Yeah, so that's really dangerous in this in this route, though. So, Professor School's gonna have to go out of his way to collect oh, these power bombs here. This is not here. good at all. This is not but these, good. These enemies hit very hard. He's hit for sixty each. Sixty each. If he takes two hits here, he's dead. Oh no, he's he's just gonna have to kill him. <laughs> he's just gonna have to kill him. And Professor yeah, or Nevdi getting the. Yep. And so, see, this is what we needed that power bomb for. Right here. Mm -hmm. He used it. He used one too early. And so we're going to be wasting a lot of time here. Oh, this is going to be a close one. They keep. This is really trading. close again now. Oh my gosh. Now, just like that, it is close again. Oh. Okay. Yup. They're, they're actually so. Oh that's my crazy. Nevdi can Kago, though. He has enough energy. That saves multiple seconds, I believe. Yeah, so Professor School is not going to Kago. Because he wants to conserve his HP here, because he does not have a lot. Oh, but Nefty misses the spark. Oh, and, the oh, professor and so does School Professor School. The second, the second short charge. Oh, Nefty, Nefty missing the door. So he's going to have to back up this firehouse room. Okay, so Nefty's choosing to farm as well. Oh, and he gets a super as well. So Nefty is looking very nice in the ammo department. Professor yeah. School could look a little better, but with some luck here, it could be okay. Okay, he at least got one super back. Yeah. Oh, and perfect. Oh yeah, Nevdi's gonna have to farm power bombs because he's gonna be doing an X Factor strat, which if done correctly, could save him a little bit of time here. Yeah. Professor School a little bit of an RNG. Professor School did enter earlier, however, his health and super count is Oh, it's definitely Ridley, worse. why do you have to be such a jerk oh. all the time, man? Give us a break. So unfortunately there, Ridley decided to do his own thing. Yeah, and in that situation, Nevdi has to wait for the X-Factor particles to hit before he can start shooting Ridley again, unfortunately. Yeah, you cannot shoot while the X-Factor particles are on screen. Uh, but as Tablespoon was saying earlier, uh, Nevdi entered later, but with more ammo, which Supers do double damage to Ridley, uh, so normally they would do 300, but to Ridley they do 600, which is equivalent to two charge shots. So very, very valuable in this fight. So having not, so having nine instead of seven saves quite a bit of time. Wow, I don't think Professor School's taken one hit. Oh, okay. Sorry, wow. my bad. <laughs> um, Still, yeah, you tons trolled. of energy though. This is yeah, looking we, good. Very good fight from Professor School. He's gonna turn off uh, Spazer and Ice for some X Factors later in Meridia. And Navdi taken. Oh! Yeah, this is looking. Okay, nice. It could be worse. Uh, um, escaping Ellen is. Also very dangerous. Very dangerous. Uh, I, <coughs> I think he feels like he can't grab the E tank. Oh, 159 is very spooky. Yeah. But we basically are, he, have to take a hopper hit in this in this room, so it just it makes things so much scarier. Yeah, so they're both gonna be taking 60 damage from that one hopper, but it allows them to do a nice short charge mock ball to destroy very those clean. bomb blocks very quick out of Wasteland, as that room is called. Hopefully Nevdi can nail it as well. Professor School is doing an uh manipulation for the key hunters in this room. Oh, he barely squeaks under that one. Okay. Oh, oh nice. I can't believe he got away with that. That was, that was that very is, nice. That was sick. That's criminal. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but very, very nice that he did not take an extra hit there. Nevdi is unable to take more oh, than one no. hit from a key hunter. Yeah, he can only so, take... Wait, can he can take one or two? Scary. He can take one. But if he gets hit twice... Oh, these guys are 50 damage, right? Busters. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, so... He this is, can't take a hit in three musketeers. He's very scary. Yeah. For Nevdi. 
I believe in Nebdy. Oh no, Professor School. Oh no. Oh my gosh. <gasps> he makes oh it. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Okay, he's in health he's fine. Form, which is not is gonna ideal. Have to pick up this E tank just to make sure that he doesn't die. And Professor School squeaks out of Ellen with 15 energy. This is crazy. Interesting decision to get Firefly tank instead of Ridley tank, but well, I think that he didn't plan on getting hit in uh, what it, what is that room called? Key Hunter stairs. And so when he did, he decided, yeah, I'm not gonna risk it anymore. We're just gonna pick up this E tank and make sure we don't die. <laughs> Which, as you can see from Professor School's angle, is very scary having low HP leaving Ridley. But now Professor School is going to be making his way towards the Various suit. Which is required for one reason and one reason only. We need it to reduce the damage of Rainbow Beam. If you don't know, Gravity Suit reduces the damage by 75% and negates heat damage, but it does not reduce rainbow beam damage. So uh, if we pick up various suit, we only need three E tanks instead of seven or six. Okay, and everybody typing in chat while he's racing. This guy is goaded. <laughs> oh, accidental power bomb. Yeah, that's gonna cause that's some okay, last though. lag frames, but it's all good. Right, hopefully, we'll see two quick clean, uh, great quick kills. Yeah, we did not get the pre order bonus for the crate DLC, so we're hopefully gonna only see half of it. And we are uh, shooting the wave beam shots off screen because it actually reduces the lag in this fight. There are some. Little doohickeys off screen that you can uh, destroy for lag reduction, and he is going to Very damage nice. boost in the spikes to uh, also reduce lag. Very, very nice. Quick kill. And there's the various suit. Nevdi is also making his way into Kraid's lair here as we speak. Yeah. Oh, and I forgot Nefty's gonna have to blow up the tank again. Oh, oh no. Oh, true. Ooh, that makes his power bomb count kind of. Yeah, so sus. that is. Well, no, he should be fine. If he he gets... should be, but he could get really unlucky depending on power bomb drops. From well, he's gonna use run. one, two. He only needs four, right? Yeah. So if but he just gets one if he here, doesn't get any. Oh, okay, so yeah, you're right. Never mind. I forgot Kraid is a thing. I'm yeah, Kraid can drop power bombs. So he's looking good now. So there you see Professor School is just going to be able to jump right into the entrance to Meridia. Well, later here in a bit, Nebdy's going to have to open that tube up. Meridia, very troll section, very BM. We don't like it. I like it. You're a freak. Okay. <laughs> uh, but a lot, it is, it, in my opinion, it is one of those sections of the game where if something goes wrong, it ain't looking good. You lose a lot of time if something goes wrong. It can certainly start to crumble. It, start, it can spiral real fast. The bosses here are very punishing if they go too far off script yes yeah. they both of them Batun and dragon have a very set script that we like to stick to but if it goes off that script it goes very bad <laughs> hopefully yep, we so see a see. clean Batun x factor oh okay i hope he's not doing d factor uh, interesting um it should be fine he, oh never no, mind <laughs> he he accidentally did a little stutter before entering the room and it messed up his speed so this is what i was talking about this is yeah not... this gives a huge opportunity to nevdi yeah, this is a very huge opportunity to nevdi and you saw earlier that nevdi had to open the tube and professor school this is interesting oh, oh, i personally would be standing further back his health is not great yeah we don't want to take i think he can take one more he can, hit. He can? Yeah. okay Okay, but it looks like Batuun is in like his second phase, I guess. So if we just stand in the bottom left corner there, should be able to just pump charge okay. shots into him and he'll go down eventually. This is really interesting, 
that they have different E tank counts. Nevdi having four. I tanks think Nevdi is... might opt to skip this E tank here because he has a lot of HP. In That's assuming... true. He might. That looks like a good defactor setup. And you'll see here the fight ends instantly. So he just made up a ton of time yeah. and getting a boatload of drops as well. Especially if he skips the spots between the E tank. E -tank. Yes, if he he's skips not too this far e -tank. behind at all. Yep, and he, he is choosing to skip it. Nice. And here it's oh no! Professor School misses the full half. He, no Nefty full could half. pull ahead here. Oh, but he bonks the door. He might just opt to do the the regular halfy. Oh, oh no, and he no. sparks up. Up spark. I don't know. That's unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. So Professor School is going to stay in the lead as they have to navigate this terrible, terrible room. They're still cooking, though. I believe in, in both of these runners. Um, these, these, these are still you still have to be very good with your movement and like mechanics to like kind of know these backups and to mitigate that time loss as much as possible sure. um know your backups nevdi's ammo is certainly looking better here yeah but he did like... take a a spark hit just... good good opener Could potentially be a problem Oh no, oh, no. no short charge. Oh, he gets Miss grabbed. Super. He messed up the short charge. Wow. This is what we were talking about. Dragon. And now it's off script, and so now we're going to be just be Bran. Okay, he gets. Oh, Nevdi seemed very low. Oh no. Opener. Yeah, but Nevdi might have. Oh no, he misses the. Charge. Oh, but okay. he, gets, he gets bailed out by RNG. Mm hmm. And just nice. like that, it's tied up. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's, this is crazy. And so both runners are going to be going for a spike suit here. Oh, oh bad Nefty frame. Gets a bad frame. Oh, no. Both, so both runners are going to have no to go back through. No spike suits, okay. Oh, and wow. Nevdi is going to be out first with better ammo and health. This is a crazy race. This is, this this is, is a crazy exactly race. Insane. Oh, my gosh. This has got to be scripted. Yeah, Nevdi's resources are great. Having six supers here. Is having very yes, nice six supers two full e tanks or almost two full e tanks oh and they're in the same room at the same time this is crazy and they're gonna moonfall here for a little bit of time save oh my I gosh i mean well, it's like less than a second at this point it's it's oh my yeah. god oh man and so it's gonna come down to just pure movement right now how well do they know these rooms Oh, and Nefty gets another, another super. They both did, right? They did. I think they both got the the super drop. And oh, and you see, just like that, Nefty the sink is crazy. Wow. Oh my gosh, Nefty makes up a little bit more time with being able to do those quick drops. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Slightly faster strat and crab shaft from Nefty, ever so slightly. They opened the, the lead. And then they're back. Time. Okay, never mind. Oh, oh but Miss Nevdi Wall just falls. Professor School opting to farm, and Nevdi does Good not because he has insane resources, and it's still synced. Oh my gosh! So coming up is it all comes uh, down to Torian. This yeah, it's, it comes down to Torian. Metroid drops. Who's gonna get better luck? Nevdi has to rely less on RNG here because he has more ammo overall. Yeah, Nevdi... the Professor School has to get a little bit more lucky. Oh, and he unfortunately takes a hit, hit there, which we do not like to see. We want to have as much HP as we can. Sometimes in Metroid Room One can go very wrong sometimes, but it That's won't true. surely. He has quite a bit. He has some room for error, but not too much. Oh no! Nevdi unfortunately messing up the blue keep there. And both runners See entering they... the green pirate shaft. Nevdi choosing not to farm anything. Professor School. Oh, and he Ooh, uses missiles on the board, letting Nevdi puts them catch up right a little bit more. Back together. And we enter Torian at the same time. Oh my gosh. Oh, brother. This point so yeah, quick Nevdi... rundown here. We need a lot of super drops from these Metroids. And they oh, don't yeah. like to give them sometimes. 
and very, very execution heavy rooms, very complex, lot of inputs. I'm, I'm wishing for the best. Oh yeah. Right now, both of these runners are looking for at least nine supers and 18 missiles to be able to complete the run without refilling yes. their missiles. Yes, that is the minimum oh. count to finish without refill. There is some leniency with a refill, but we do not want to do that. That loses a lot of time. Yep, and Hopefully so both, you'll see both runners here turn Without too much headache. This is crazy. Wow. I'd be having a little bit more health, but that shouldn't be too much of a factor here. And you saw both of them have to turn back on Ice Beam and Spazer so they can freeze and destroy the Metroids. Oh, no supers from the first one. Oh, and he... Oh. Oh, this is fine, surely. Okay, good supers. Good supers. Both have the same super count going into M2. Oh, wow, Nebdy's already full. Oh, and Professor School. Only having six. It sh should be okay. He should be okay. But he could get unlucky. Okay. Yeah, yeah having okay, some missile. Fine. So he, they, both runners can use a super missile here because of that extra missile pack. They will not have to worry about getting scammed. While it is unlikely. Boost. Oh no. It's fine. He can okay. missile here if you. Yeah, he's playing it very safe. I respect. That a lot. Oh, uh, the health is not looking very good for Professor e School here. Yikes! He oh, might, oh, I cannot he believe might, he got away with yeah. that. Criminal. So he if might he took a take air, a he would have had the refill regardless. Okay, here's Baby Skip. Hold. Baby Skip saves a lot of time. We definitely want to get this. Hold. Ooh, accidentally causing a lag. And Nefty's through. Professor School is next. And both runners okay. are through, but this is... Will oh. he take the refill? No. no. Okay. No. Um, assuming he does a Rinka boost, or a Rinka Zeb skip, Professor he School could, only he has could do 10 it again, health is possible. of room. Uh, does but. it even matter? I'm pretty sure everything just no, 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 no. with one hit. Everything once hit. If he chooses to do... Actually, no, it doesn't matter. Okay. Professor cannot School take... cannot take any hits from Mother Brain If he two. takes another Rinka hit here, I think he's... It's over. This is a, a very long and tedious fight. Oh. It is a battle of attrition. Hits. Oh, Nebdy could still sickening. die as well, but he does have room for some of the attacks. Yes. And so, he also has extra ammo. He has an extra super to use, which will uh, make this fight a little bit faster for Nev-D. Yeah, so 60 charge shots. Professor School cannot take a single hit. Everything kills him. Yeah, you cannot dip below 300 energy here. Those underings do 20 damage. Oh, and those french fries do a lot. Is it 40? Maybe 40. Oh, nice tech. Morphing to... Oh, they're both morphing a bunch. To oh, they're these, uh, being very aggressive. Meatballs. Chill out, please! Chill out! Mother brain! Oh my oh, gosh. Oh, morphing under the... This is a, a lot more morphing than I'm used to seeing. Oh my god! Oh, oh my gosh! Okay, entering catch-up phase. She's going crazy! Wait, so Professor School got in catch-up phase first, right? Is, I believe I so. I think Nevdi has maybe missed some shots here and there. But, like I said earlier, he had that super in his pocket. Okay, Professor School is done with the fight first. He pulls ahead, doing a damage list. Oh my gosh, it's gonna come down to the escape. Mother Brain 3 and escape. Both players not taking any hits, which is. You'd love to see it. Living through the MB2 fight, it can be very stressful, and especially in this environment. But very, very clean fights. 
No hits from either runners. We're in the home stretch here. Oh, yeah. But it is not over till we are on the ship. Professor School has a slight lead here, but that could change throughout Escape. It is very easy to lose time in Escape. Very difficult rooms. You have to have a very precise movement, a lot of ledge grabs. Oh, this is a crazy race. I'm so happy uh, we got to do this. <laughs> I'm. Me too, man. I'm so excited. <laughs> I cannot believe this is a. Clear, a lot of like... lead changes throughout the entire oh, run. This is crazy. Yeah, Professor School does have a lead for sure, but I don't think it's big enough that he can really screw around and escape. Now both runners are going to have to lock in. It is time to lock in. Both entering Mother Brain 3 very close to each other. Fortunate meatball for Nevdi. This is a very satisfying fight from both runners. Oh, Nevdi yeah. unfortunately missing a few shots there. Giving Professor School Professor's a little more of a lead. Yeah, he's pulling ahead a little bit. I, s I swear if this guy gets the Escape could go I'm either way. Lose. Yeah, it is still not over. Timer stops when they're on the ship. Just a little bit more than a minute left of gameplay. Maybe we'll even see another lead change for this race is over. Yeah, one, I mean, it's very possible that something bad could happen, which I'm hoping it won't. We're going to take a hit from that pirate there intentionally, so we have some iframes to wall jump through that pirate, do some little lag reduction there. Oh, Nevi's going up the right side there. The moonfall from Professor School. As well as Nebby. Leodox from Professor School. Very good Leodox Blood from both clock. our runners. Nice behemoth spark. Good spark up the climb room. Both runners get it. All that's left All good, is gonna come down the landing pilot. site. No, no major mistakes from Professor very, School. Very, very clean escape from Professor School. And Professor GG. School has finished with an official race time .gg time of 46.51 and Nefty only five seconds behind with an official time of 46.56 on race time. Good game. That was a sick race. That was unbelievable, I've got to say. That was spectacular performance from both the runners. That is, wow. Oh, and it looks like we have our two racers uh, ready to come in here for a little bit of a talk about the run. Nevdi and Professor School, how are you do guys doing? Professor School, congrats on beating out Nevdi and <laughs> not dying in Lower Norfair. That is crazy. How are you feeling about the the room or the run? Uh, excuse me. I'll. It's. So I'll say I'm happy. I had, I was not watching the restream. I am pleased that the audience had a good show and that <laughs> Nebby and I had a close race. Um, we have a tendency, he and I, of having close races. In fact, oh I think the last time that we raced was um, something like a 12 frame difference separating oh us in a, in a pretty insane GT Classic race. So I'm glad that I didn't die in LN. I was on Nevdi. I was on like, I don't know. 15. You, yeah, it was oh really bad. Gosh. It was really bad. Um, overall, I'm not really happy. I've I've been PBing at a pretty regular rate since switching to PRKD. I got a, a 44.19 actually just two nights ago. Uh, so being plus two and a half on my PB when my worst run in three months has been like a, like a mid 45 is kind of frustrating. Uh, I was pretty nervous. I don't know why I was nervous. There's no reason for me to be nervous, but I was when I was put on the restream. And 
once I dipped in the moat twice, you thought that I'd relax and I just sort of tensed up and, and I think it showed. So there's nine more quals. I'll have another shot at it. Um, but uh, the important thing is we had a, a good race. Both of the runners finished a difficult route. And uh, yeah, I'd be curious to see what happened on your end, Nebdy. Oh, it was great. Uh, it was a good time. I, had, I fell everywhere. It was, it was good. <laughs> <laughs> it certainly got a little sketchy with the it was... spark, but yeah, you made it work. <laughs> This is uh this is the really quite a big gap of a race for me and Prost stand. It's like five seconds. That's that's a it's a mile. May as well yeah, for for us that's actually a huge that's a huge blowout victory actually. <laughs> I am so happy because of the race was so good. We yeah, were shambling. Was I was watching the race. I was talking. Thing. I was having a great time. It was great. chatting um, it up. <laughs> and we failed. We 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 were each failing just enough to get the race to be really good. I mean, hopefully we cut these runs out of our, you know, thing. I'm, still, it's I'm thinking be... you guys were, you guys were talking behind the scenes, planning out where you're messing up or something. Oh, I wish oh, I, you, I should have claimed that. Oh yeah, this was totally staged. It was an intentional mistake there. <laughs> I totally no, planned no. the fallen mode a hundred times. That's what I love to do every run. Exactly. Yeah. I mean, I, I will say there are certain things that I changed in the last 72 hours, uh, specifically to try to survive. So I stopped doing, just for the quals, I, I stopped doing D-boosts in Hellway, so I have more energy for Fantoon. Um, I took out Lava oh, yeah. Spark, so I would just have Gravity Jump. Um, if I'm full on PBs, I still farm the Violas going down to Gravity Jump so that I get a little bit of extra health going into Worst Room in the game. Uh, yeah, my Worst Room in the game was a nightmare. Holy smokes! <sighs> I have not messed that room up at all, at all, in probably like 15 times in LN. and. I was just like half a tile low on the jump yeah. to get out. And yep. then when I reset the room, I don't know what I did. I got I was too close to the wall and I got bodied as soon as I did my second. I forgot, Nevdi, I don't know if you saw this. I forgot that I had to reset the room twice. So I wasn't even no thinking about bombs. my power bomb count. And I could have yeah. just done bomb spread. I don't know what I was yeah. thinking. And then I was like, wait a minute, what's my power bomb count? I can't <laughs> believe that I didn't die going to power bombs of shame there's so much about this run that was so awful the fact i survived is incredible so <laughs> yeah, yeah it's um it's pretty cool like getting more serious i guess it's in a race format sm's like very different like a lot of the time unless yes. you're doing no reset runs and you're used to this sort of stuff but a lot of the time you just smack out of this run you, you just go okay yeah whatever you just turn it off you can't turn it off in a race you just have to right. deal with it and do what's necessary and it just makes the game look so hard and people talk about this game being so hard i mean we've already had so many um forfeits already it's it's really hard and it's really hard to bring back these mistakes while maintaining a good time so mm -hmm. in that sense it was cool to cool to see that we were both shambling but we both stayed alive to get it done mm -hmm. it's way harder than doing a run normally i think <laughs> it's doing yeah, it's it's getting it's yeah. back on the rails it's yeah, it's yeah. I love this stuff, but again, not happy with the run either of us. Happy with the result though, and happy with um the way it looked on stream for sure. Yeah, a hundred percent. You guys gave it was, an amazing, it was an amazing show. Yeah, that's awesome. I'm and and I will say, back. if I'm if I'm taking my if I'm taking the the advice of people who tell me to be kinder to myself, uh, whenever our last any percent tournament was, this is the type of time a high forty six that I would have been thrilled to get mm. in a qualifier. The fact that I came back to the category, switched to PRKD, and I'm now running like low 44s and on the cusp of a 43 is, is pretty freaking exciting. So I, I, I think that uh, this is just one, this is one little bump in the road and hopefully the tournament has good things in store for both Nevdi and I. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I, you guys just uh, were amazing. I, I had an absolute blast commentating. You guys put on such an amazing show. Um, any thoughts, uh, Spoon, or anyone else? Any la any last words here? Because I think we're just about done. I just I can't believe no one died. That was crazy. <laughs> there are a lot of scary moments for sure. Yeah. Well, I'm looking forward to watching it back. I want to say thank you so much to uh, both uh, Memes and Tablespoon for the for the comms. I'm sure they were excellent. Looking forward to to watching the restream. Thank you to everyone who put that restream together. And uh, hey, you know what? Maybe in the in the backdoor bracket, Nevdi and I will find each other in one of those like seven ten matchups again or something like that. <laughs> that we, we, we can do the redo That'd be on awesome. this. Awesome. Yeah. Well, yeah. like like he said, thank thank you everybody. Uh, for watching, uh, uh, this has been an absolute blast. Um, 
yes, please give these runners a follow. I know they, they would very much appreciate it. Absolute bonkers runners. Very, very talented. Um, but if that's it, then uh, thank you guys all so much for watching. And we will see you all next mission.